I think I should warn you, Glenn, if I haven't already, that I have an almost infinite capacity for this kind of jazz. You mean the dancing or the drink? Oh, the whole bit. I'm a smash at everything that takes me nowhere or is even a little bit actively bad for me. Honey, you underestimate yourself. You a smash at being good company. Cheers. Message for you, Mr. Evans. Oh, thanks a lot. Excuse me. Bad news? Hmm? Not for someone, certainly. Gonna have to desert you for a couple of minutes. Uh, the last man who said that to me hasn't been heard from yet. He obviously wasn't on a small freighter in the middle of the Pacific Ocean now, was he? Have another drink and I'll catch up. Hey! I'm only one drink ahead. You'll have no trouble catching up. Here I come. Look, if something's bugging you, you don't have to be polite. I'll go away. No, 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 no. no. Stay and talk to me. Well, um, then let's talk about that sailor off our ship who was killed back in Hong Kong. Did you hear about that? The bar steward told me it's all over the ship. <laughs> I guess that figures. Well, anyone for dancing? Crazy. It's a little long to pretend it's my high school junior prom, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Besides, kids grow up awful fast. Oh, let's not grow up too fast. First thing you know, everything gets so serious. I brought you up here to be serious. That's what I was afraid of. It's very serious business. Oh, we're not the type, either one of us. Oh, I don't know. I think we made rather a charming couple in there. Uh, you haven't even known me 24 hours. It's long enough. For what? To warn you as a friend. I thought that's what I was supposed to be doing. Huh? Oh, I'm not warning you against Glenn Evans. You've got to take your chances with him. Oh? Do huh? you know what's going to happen when we dock at Honolulu? Uh-uh. The police are going to come on board and start investigating the death of that sailor back in Hong Kong. So? I didn't kill him. I know you didn't, but the ship's going to be searched and everybody on it. Jesse. That wireless message was from Inspector Campbell. Talbot had a record as a smuggler. That means special agents from Customs are going to come on board and nose around. Still think it's Jazzy? Yeah. Just thought I'd tell you in case you were smuggling in a few pounds of opium to your old aunt in Peoria. I don't have to. She grows her own poppies. Jazzy? Me an hour, will you, Glenn? An hour? Just who are you dressing for? You, darling. Any objections? Put it that way, no. Yeah, come in. 